people of the butterfly here, otherwise known as people of seven on Twitter and YouTube, people of elsewhere on the internet. My blog is located at purple butterfly dash people dot blogspot dot com. And my soaps, Purple Butterfly Soaps, can be found at peepla.etsy.com. This is day three of I'm finding myself revisiting old habits. Like I keep catching myself grinding my teeth, which is kinda how I lost my teeth in the first place. So I'm going to have to look up what to do about that. I mean, I used to have nighttime bruxism. Basically, you stuck this thing in your mouth like a guard. Kept you from grinding at night. Well, at night, my teeth will be going in this with, you know, some effervescent stuff or effervescent denture cleaner stuff. But during the day... You know, I guess when I hear the cooking sound or feel the jaw hurt, because, yeah, that's accompanied by pain, which reminded me, hey, yeah, duh, don't do that no more. Then maybe I'll consciously stop myself. But I found that really interesting that she just did. And there's like a toothache here and here, and right over here, there's no teeth. So, how's there a toothache? So, I guess the sensation from the grinding or just the fact that there was teeth, then there was no teeth, now there's teeth again. Let me put you back with the sensations you had when you had teeth. That has good connotations and bad connotations because I've been able to eat and bite with, you know, and I could feel the difference in the temperature and I could taste my coffee and my food. But by the same token, that pain I got from the grinding my teeth thing, yeah, because my brain is like, hey, no teeth, no pain. No spontaneous bleeds from the teeth and the grinding. So, yeah, I'm going to have to do better about that because they're cute. I've just gotten used to having them in three days. They went in like 9 o'clock this morning. And I want to be able to at least make it to 9 o'clock this night because I almost did 12 hours yesterday. And... They had to come out. It was just sore, you know. It's like, well, they're going to be even more sore with the grinding thing. So I'm going to have to work on that. Um, I did find out real quick, can't spit. It's like you get all the salivation and all that, that you can swallow. But if you need to spit something out, I guess I can. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. No, I don't pull it anyway. But I have discovered something else you need, too. Watch this. I was singing along to a song. And in the song, they have whistling. And I always make this hollow sound, pretending like I'm whistling, even before the dentures. Definitely when I had no teeth. And now there's a very clear whistle sound. I've never been able to whistle in my life without doing the reverse inhale type whistle. And when it came time to, you know, whistle with the sound coming out, it would sound like that. And I would, you know, still do the motion. Because I like whistles. But now I can do this. Thank 
Don't go though if my um, lips are wet. I can't do it. I can't do the song yet, but just the fact that I can do a whistle, I'll work on that. <laughs> yeah, I'm being a little goofy, but this is all a new experience to me, so part of, shall we say, rehabbing uh, old problem become new is to share. So that way maybe my experience will help somebody else while I am getting used to this new challenge. That's like the speaking. I don't know if I'm actually speaking slower, but I'm consciously trying to slow down my words. But with the voice pattern I've always had and the speech pattern and the linguistic, I generally tend to talk very, very quickly. But... Because of this new method of speaking, I have yet to bite my lip even once today. So, that's a good thing. The little red, bruised, brown, gray spots on my tongue have healed up from no biting my tongue before I lost my teeth, you know, with the spontaneous bleeds and all that and the biting. So, with this new format, no biting, and then at the time I would have bit, especially at night with the teeth grinding and all that and the teeth would be in the jar, I won't have to worry about that again and I won't have to worry about spontaneous bleeds again. This is my prayer. This is my hope. This is what... I'm going to be striving for, and then I'm going to have to figure out how much food to put in, because right now, they're moving around, <laughs> but when I put in too much, it oozed out and felt like it was closing my throat from the adhesive, but I learned a little trick with this. If I bite on something... It lifts up the teeth and it actually pulls them out of my mouth. So I figured that'd be a quick way to get them out if I need to get them out. But it also helped to center and seat the teeth. So, enough of that subject. I have coffee. And lunch is ready. So I'm going to go hang out with mom and spend time with family, eat some food, and I will talk to you guys later. Don't forget, um, my blog is located at purplebutterfly-peepla.blogspot.com and Purple Butterfly Soaps can be located at peepla.etsy.com. Buy some soap, buy some jewelry, buy everything in my shop, so that way I have enough room to make some more stuff so you can buy it. And enjoy it. And y'all stay blessed and stay tuned. Bye now. Oh, and to my new subscribers, thank you so much. And to anybody that's interested, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And to my old subscribers, thank you for hanging in there with me. Bye now.